Hey guys, um, well, I have this problem. I tried today, um, I wanted to record for you guys and, um, uh, how to make a Minecraft bucket server. I tried, but like, I don't know what happened to my computer. It just wouldn't let me. The bat problem file command thing is like not working. The start dot bat. So, I'm gonna keep trying and trying until I get it right. And then once I get it right, excuse me, excuse me, once I get it right, um, I'll, sh I'll record for you guys and show you how to do it and um, if you have any problems just leave it down below in the description and um, I'll try to fix you I'll call you on Skype or something or add you and then we'll do it together and um, yeah guys um, so yeah I will like I'll try and try to like get it right and once I get it right I'll just record for you guys and um, yeah so enjoy the video guys see ya hey what's going on guys Minecraft tutorials here and um, welcome back to another video guys so um I'm going to be showing you guys how you can put forward any Minecraft server, any version, it doesn't really matter. So, um, what you're going to need to do first is, um, I go on the search bar. If you don't know how to do that, I'll, I'll, I'll leave a, well, actually, I'll do it now. So, you, you, you move your mouse into any, like, side, and then this should come up. Press search. This should come up. This is how you do it. And then write, write in run, or, uh, uh, uh or CMD. I would just write run, boom, and then he writes CMD. That's the way on how you can get to command prompt. Uh, there's two ways. Um, so, yeah. So, what you're going to need to write when you're on this page is write I-P-C-O-N-F-I-G. And then go up. Something sh should say default getaway. Get getaway. And then mine is 192.168.0.1. Yours should be different, uh, well, if it's not different, it will actually has to be different, because if you live in the same house as me, it won't be different, but if you don't uh, live in the same house as me, it will be different. So, uh, yours should be different, mine's 192.168.0.1, go on Google and type up this, 192.168.0.1, if this uh, page doesn't come up, uh, well, stop watching this video because it's not gonna work for you. I'm sorry guys, but like if it doesn't come up, sorry for you guys that doesn't work, it, that it doesn't work for you. So the the by default the username should be admin, password should be password, and then um uh, if it's not password um a, a family member or your mother or uh, your mother or father changed it or maybe you changed it. So ask them and then after you ask them um uh just write the password in and then press remember my yeah remember so you don't have to keep asking them and annoying them um so yeah just press ok and then uh well you start from basic go to advanced and then go to advanced setup then port forwarding slash port triggering and then well delete sorry guys um and then you should start off on that nothing should be here nothing at all should be here um, all you need to do from here is just add custom service. Uh, name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it tutorial. T U T O R I tutorial video. And then your external starting point should be by default 25565. If you don't want it to be that, uh, change it if you want. And then 25565. And then. Um, you have to do this um, to know how, what it is. Go on your uh, your command prompt, and then see where it says IPv4 address. Mine is 192.168.0.5. For me, it always change. Uh, it always changes, so I don't know why, but like yeah. Um, see where it says here 192.168.0.5. You can press five, or you can just tick that, and then press apply. And then boom, guys, this is how you put forward your Minecraft server. I'm sorry if it if you can't do it. Um, and, um, yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching, and, um, I hope you enjoyed the video.